welcome to another episode of Getting Off the Hamster Wheel, how to find a career that brings you joy, fulfillment, and success. My name is Karen Weeks, and for those who don't know me, I'm a coach who focuses on helping people transform their career to to get unstuck and find something they enjoy. And actually, it ties to bigger life goals as well. No matter where you're feeling stuck in your life, it impacts other areas of your life as well. And I want people to really understand that. So in today's episode, as a follow-up to Regard's episode last week, I really want to focus on identifying those different areas of your life that could be impacting your satisfaction at work so that you can really figure out the root cause of your frustration and the root cause of feeling stuck. So let's dive into that a little bit more. I personally call it shine bright with you in the center at radiating everything amazing that can happen in your life. That could be your career about how you feel about your finances and your financial stability or potential? What is your home life like, both literally where you live and how that is set up and the people that are with you at home, which ties directly into relationships, not just love relationships, but family and friends and just people you interact with? How does that impact your health and both physical and mental? Is it stress and burnout? Is it mental illness? Is it physical? Are you eating well with your nutrition and and exercise? And then finally, purpose. You can call this spirituality. You could call this how you feel in your soul, whatever you want to call it. I like purpose because it's sort of this connection to a bigger meaning in life. So those are the different areas of your life and how you can shine bright. Career, finances, home, relationship, health, and purpose. So today's mini episode is really just going to be focused on one challenge. Where are you feeling the most dim? Where are you feeling the most stuck? And how is that impacting other areas of your life? And really dig deep. You may be really annoyed at work right now and thinking that you're just unhappy in your job, but take a step back. Are there other areas in your life where you're struggling as well? Are those impacting your job or is your job impacting that other area? Maybe you're really frustrated with something going on at home and you're feeling burnt out from that. So of course you're not bringing all your energy to work. Or maybe it really is your job and you're really unsatisfied in your job and it's impacting your health because at the end of the day, the last thing you want to do is eat well or work out or meditate or any of the things that you do for your health. Maybe you're questioning what your bigger purpose is and how does that tie to your career? Or honestly, how does that tie to your financial stability? Some people think that if to make a difference in life means they have to work for a nonprofit or something where they can't make money, and that may not be the truth. The point of all of that is to think about these different areas of your life, everything that makes you, you, your career, your finances, your home life, relationships, health, and your purpose. And where are you truly feeling the most stuck? When you take a step back and look at the bigger picture, what's the driver of feeling stuck? And then what's one small thing that you can do to start getting unstuck? Is it letting go of something, some sort of expectation or label? Is it nailing what you really want to be doing instead? Again, doing does not mean career. Doing could be, I really want to be exercising more and something's holding me back. Is it that you don't share your goals with others. There's more and more data every single day how shared goals and communicated goals are more apt to be followed through and achieved because you've talked to them out loud to somebody. Is it that you feel like you have areas of your life that you're just not paying attention to and so you want to improve your skills or give yourself more time to work on something? Is it just that you don't even know what any of that is? You just know something needs to change in this one area of your life. Thinking through any of those possibilities, what's one thing you can do today, one small little thing, one push-up, moving $5 into savings, moving around a chair and a table at your house, finding real purpose by meditating and thinking about bigger purposes in life. Whatever it is, do it for yourself because it will impact every other piece of your life and you will therefore feel unstuck in other areas as well. That's the purpose of all this is finding those opportunities. As always, my goal with these podcasts, especially these mini episodes, are to give you actionable things. So tonight or this morning or whenever you're listening to this, think about what one thing you can do differently to help you shine bright and really focus on other areas of your life where you may be feeling stuck. 
And if you want to talk about it or need some help thinking through it, give me a shout. I'm here to help. I offer one-on-one coaching. I'm going to be offering workshops about this specific topic. But in general, I just want to help. So let's connect. Of course, also please consider subscribing, sharing these episodes with others, and leaving a rating review on the platform of your choice to help spread the word about this podcast. I can't say it enough. I just want to help. So let's make sure we connect, share these experiences with others, And until next time, remember, there's always a way to get off the hamster wheel, both in your career and in your life.